East, just kidding, West, East. All right, Robert Rasko Jr., everybody. Good job. I pull over, 
He comes up to the window, the cop, he's about six foot two, blonde hair, blue eyes. I thought, I'm going to get him. He stuck my head out and I said, no hablo inglés. He goes, no problema, yo hablo español. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so he comes up to the window. We're not done yet, right? And so um, he says, can I see your ID? And I'm quick again. Sir, that's in my wife. We don't want any more kids. <laughs> and then he comes and he says, sir. And he says, are those chihuahuas papers? Like they have papers. You know what? I'm tired of the profiling. I said, you know what? These dogs were born here in the United States. <laughs> he bought a chihuahua and gave me a ticket for no uh, seatbelt. <laughs> do that. Okay, so how about, uh, let me tell you about my white friend, Ralph. Him and I are pretty tight. He said I need some spirituality in my life, and so I decided that I was going to go ahead and go church hopping. So I did that for six months, and I'm the kind of guy that likes to, you know, join everything. So I was baptized six times, and that's the only time I'll admit to being a wetback. Okay? That's it. So anyway, um, so anyway, Ralph says, go ahead, and uh, you need to not necessarily join a religion, but just get spiritual. I found a book on earth-centered religion, you know, the kind of like tree hugger type of thing. And I decided to read that book, and I was drinking my tequila. Oh, boy. Oh, about 3 a.m., I was outside without my clothes, hugging a tree, and I got arrested. <laughs> Not good. i do that. Um, I'd like to invite everybody in the future here in about another four months. Here in Twin Falls, we're going to have for the first time ever the Magic Valley Latino Comedy Hour. Bring a white friend and you get 50% off. <laughs> okay? And don't kick my ass, it's all right. It's good. Well, I'm about out of time. Um, and being Mexican, I'm going to take 10 more minutes. <laughs> <That's> all right? <laughs> okay? Anyway, um, I decided to learn a third language. You know, get competitive out there, right? Sign language. Mostly my middle finger. And they're working pretty good so far. All right? Anyway, I had this job for a short period of time. And I'm one of those guys that like to stare. Right? And I had a, a fellow worker who had these big tits. Now, I don't know about you guys, but man, I just like, I was focused. Right? HR department called me and said, Robert, you can't be doing that. And I said, you know what? And I mean, they're going to fire me for this, right? So what the hell? I said, you know, I could have touched them. <laughs> got fired. That was a three-day job. <laughs> but I did learn some sign language, though. That's a good deal. I've been learning some good stuff. There's a, um, there's one, one, one time I had a job, and I guess this means thank you in sign language. And um, we had some people in there one time that were uh, customers, and they were finishing up, and I wanted to be polite, and I went. And uh, I'll fire tonight, job too. So the economy's pretty tough. I'll probably keep doing this for a while. Um, thank you. I'm running out of time. Good night. <laughs>